Hi, today I will show you how to use the PostGrid Gutenberg blocks. From WordPress admin navigation go to plugins menu then add new. In search bar type the PostGrid. Now see the PostGrid shortcode, Gutenberg blocks and Elementor add-on plugin come. Now click install now button and activate the plugin. You can use the PostGrid plugin as shortcode, Elementor widget as well as Gutenberg block. Now select which way you want to use then click save. Now go to WordPress page then click the plus icon from the top left of Gutenberg editor. Now find the post grid 3 blocks show in the Gutenberg blocks list. Let's click on grid layout block to see how the grid layouts work. Now from the settings sidebar from the content tab select the layout from the layout option set column, layout style and text alignment. Then most important is query build select post source from the common filter set include and exclude by id, can set limit and offset. From advanced filters, you can select single or multiple categories. Same for the tag, can select the author and keyword also can set order by and sort ordering. To enable pagination click show pagination then set display per page and pagination type. Can enable or disable detail page link. Now move the settings tab from the field selection settings enable or disable which fields want to show. From the section title select title style, title source and title tag. From post title select title tag, title visibility style and title position. From thumbnail settings select media source then select image size. From excerpt settings select excerpt type, excerpt limit and excerpt indicator. Now move to Styles tab from Style Settings you can set Typography, Color and other style related settings as you need to style your grid. Now click publish button and see the front end look of the grid layout. Now we will see how the list block works. Click on list layout to insert the list block. After call the list block from the settings sidebar set the different settings and style as you want.
Now click update button to see how the list layout look in front end. Now we will see how the grid hover layout works. To insert grid hover layout click on grid hover block. After call the grid hover block from the settings sidebar set the different settings and styles as you want. Now click the update button to see how the grid hover layouts look in front end. Thanks for watching our video. If you face any issue please mail support at radiustheme.com.